Hi, good day. This is Jonathan from GCloud Web Host. Today, we would like to do a website review for a website, cyberjrpainball.com. This is their front page. And what they do, uh, cyberjrpainball.com has a park and they are offering uh, recreational packages for pinball players that is how they uh, do their business so basically this is a website a simple website they have all the information and I would like to share how can this website improve by looking at the existing problems the website has today. So what are the problems that I realize when I see the website? Yeah, they have their own uh, social media platform as well in Facebook page. This is the page they're using. And uh, they are heavily depend on um, Facebook page, Instagram. Uh, they might oversee, overlook uh, certain social media potential, such as Pinterest, Twitter, YouTube, for example. With the current website they have, the second problem is they are not able to analyze business data because it's not captured in the first place and we do not understand and know the customer behaviors. With the data, business data, we are able to analyze and understand custom, customer behavior. Without that, uh, it's super difficult to understand the part of the business and do not have a centralized depository area to manage the business data i will share that by giving example later do not understand the potential and possibility of selling pinball related items online yeah that can be the option but because currently the website is not actively involved in that um, and another uh, problem is an attractive website can draw potential business owner or events to advertise on Cypher Jaya Pinball website but today uh, we don't see that happening so these are the problem uh, with the website today so a general solution uh, what we can enhance is to look at uh, a registration page to capture audiences contact in order to build their own database who is relevant to their business they can still do manual follow-up to close the deals and once the booking is confirmed or approved that will be uh, updated in their Google Calendar automatically and in the process we also need to follow up with uh, any participants who sign up or register but do not enroll to the games and we can do that by using a follow-up email list to manage future expectation from the existing audiences who register but have yet started playing the games in the park. Another uh, critical option here is the feedback email list to get uh, to manage the feedback expectation from the customer. So these are the few examples that 
you can do with the website if the website is up and running uh, we can use all these tools to help us to manage the expectation and understand the customer behavior much better so what do I do if I'm the marketing manager yeah first page I will have a showcase of the paintball games to attract the attention not so much about the park and on top or uh, anywhere on the front page we can put a form to encourage the audiences to submit their contact information so that the management can get back to the people who are interested in uh, having fun at the Cyberjaya Pinball Park. So for audience who are not joining the games, they, they do register but they do not pay for the game. Uh, the email list uh, can follow up with them once a week, once a month is up to uh, the management to decide for the period of three to six months. This is where the copy add copy skill apply and you will determine the success or failure of the follow up. So that is another part of the knowledge. Um, for those who join the games, then we can activate the feedback email list to anticipate whether this is a good or bad feedback based on a survey question in the email proactively. So if we can manage the expectation proactively, we can also reduce the negative feedback tremendously. That is what I believe. Yeah. So if you do provide good service, there's no reason that uh, they uh, can give you a negative feedback. So the benefits of WordPress uh, website okay uh, i'm using a cloud system it could be amazon azure or uh, alibaba or google so the these are the benefits five benefits benefits that uh, i list it down the first one when you post you make a post on the blog the the post can automatically be updated in Facebook page, Pinterest, or whatever social media that you have uh, at one go. Yeah, you don't have to go to all your social media uh, platform to post the same information. So that is the benefit of having the WordPress website with blog posts. When you post at one location, you'll copy the same post to the rest of the social media platform. Point number two, you can also create an email within WordPress to blast out to the rele relevant audiences. And the same email can be used for the blog post as well. So you save your effort from posting, writing email and posting on other social media. What I'm saying is you can write an email in WordPress. Once you completed the email, you can have the option whether you want to post this email on the blog post. If you decided to post that on the blog post, the same process will go through as well. You will automatically update your other social media platform as well at the same time on the same day. Yeah, so you have two stone, one stone kill two birds. Email blast, decided to post, just put a check mark, post on the blog. The blog will then replicate, copy the post information to the rest of the social media. Save time, save money. You can sleep better. Point number three is a centralized depository for the business so that every member of the business has the right per permission to access the data without depending on individual inbox to capture data because currently um, if you're still using uh, 
inbox to manage your business uh, that is uh, a bit outdated and the good thing about the website is the data can be backed up regularly and automatically you don't have to worry and yeah sleep much better again point number four whatsapp can be embedded in the system so that whatsapp can also capture audience phone number plus emails and all this information can be uploaded for later purposes and last point that i have you can encourage public who have attended the games in the cyberjr pinball park to upload to upload and publish their own photo gallery gallery to share with cyberjaya pinball audiences so you allow them to post their own photo into your website into cyberjaya pinball website and and you can actually uh, approve or disapprove it's up to the administrator to decide or you want to give them the permission to uh, just post and do their whatever comments they have they can write their own story as an author yeah so these are the benefits of having a wordpress website uh, especially uh, what i like is in google platform uh, so a few references that uh, can be used to enhance the, the website which is a video yeah video uh, persuasive writing and another uh, reference is uh, unlimited uh, email set up for you so these are the two references you can check it out and that's all for today for uh, cyber jaya pinball website um, I would like to review more website in the future. Don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for listening.